Hey there, church. Welcome to the first ever episode of By the Numbers. My name is Liam Conley, and one of the things that I get to do as a part of my job is oversee all the numbers at Harvest Vineyard Church. Every business or ministry should have a numbers guy, and for HVC, that's me, and I love getting to do it. I wanted to give you, as our church family, just a quick update, a numbers update, on all the things that we're seeing God do in and through Harvest Vineyard Church thanks to your generosity. Even though we've been in a pandemic for around four months and things happening at the church building are not happening quite as often, we're actually seeing the opportunity to do even more ministry and more outreach, reaching out to our community and also globally uh, to reach people for Jesus. So we're able to do these things because of the strong financial position that we're in. That being said, let's take a look at the numbers. We have given out 250 food bags to anyone that signs up online and wants to receive one. These are big bags full of canned goods and dry food, but over this summer, we've actually been able to partner with a local farm, Mustard Seed Farm, and have fresh produce available to the food bags that we're giving out. We give these out by delivery and also by drive up here at the church. And like I said, 250 food bags so far since uh, the pandemic started in March. We've also given away $8,600 in grocery gift cards to bless our church family and anyone that they know in the community that might need help with groceries. So that's 86 $100 gift cards to places like Aldi, Hy-Vee, Fairway, or Walmart. It's so cool that we've been able to do that. A few months back, we began a COVID-19 response fund where you could donate money that would go directly to helping and blessing people who are experiencing hardship due to the coronavirus. This fund received $1,800 in donations that went right to food bags, grocery gift cards, and rent and utility assistance for those who qualified. We were also able to kick off an online campus without too much trouble thanks to a few very generous donations. We've been reaching people all over the world with our online services. And this has been one of the great benefits in the midst of the current crisis. We plan to continue offering these high quality online services and this online campus for the foreseeable future. And then we've been able to give $7,500 in extra gifts to our international missionaries and our local partners. So we have people that we're partnering with in the Netherlands, Hawaii, Montenegro, Haiti, and more. And then our local partners are ministries and organizations like Food at First, Wings of Refuge, Informed Choices, now called Obria, the Emergency Residence Project, and Home for a While. And so because of your generosity toward the church, we've been able to be generous with our community partners and our missionaries. So I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for your faithful giving to the ministry of Harvest Vineyard Church. Thank you for your trust as we steward the resources of our church family. And thank you for furthering the kingdom and the cause of Christ in Ames, in Central Iowa, and beyond. Don't hesitate to reach out to me with any questions. Thank you and God bless.